Good morning guys. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, as you can see my bike is totally dirty because I was riding in a uh, Kaysan province few days ago. Then it was raining and it got dirty. So why I didn't wash I'll tell you why. Okay. So I just noticed two weeks ago I am having some issue on this ZH2. The issue is not nothing is and serious but you can see here this is a clutch master cylinder and the paint is gone so I asked Kawasaki why is happening so they inspected and uh, they said okay we will do it so they have to do it because this is under warranty that is you know it should not be removed the color and all the stuff so actually they send the parts in Kawasaki crib Libis so the Archie the mechanic the head mechanic called me up and he said the parts is there two days ago so I said okay before I am going to wash my bike let me do the mechanical work and I just lubricate on all the stuff then I will wash so guys I will uh, see you in a uh, in few minutes in Kawasaki crib I am just near I'm in uh, C5 C5 always you know traffic but uh, I don't have any choice so uh, it's near the Kawasaki crib is near my house so I told him 10 o'clock but it's already 10 30 so also guys I just want to say that uh, me and Biahe Newland as you know guys Biahe Newland always with me in Team Kirat and he has a channel he do charity and all the stuff so we are actually planning to go tomorrow or day after tomorrow in Bulacan there is a uh, one motorcycle rider actually he got accident nine, nine years ago and uh, he paralyzed and he is in the bed nine years that is a crazy thing so I, he sent me a message few weeks ago and uh, asked me that Kuyanaji if you can just help me out for my medicine of course I am here to help especially you know this kind of situation he cannot even move from the bed and he has I think horse in his throat and all the things so I feel so kawawa so I just asked my small group called Team Kirat Team Kirat is not a big huge group Team Kirat is just a few people only we are the we are just a few friends from uh, Z1PH we used to have a Z1000 group so from 2015 we had uh, that group like uh, maybe 10 or 15 of them and whoever sold the C Z1000 they bought you know BMW S1000R and uh, XR and other bikes so we used to ride especially you know long rides and uh, uh, overnight rides most of them in Z1 group so they stream Kiraz mostly we ride uh, you know long rides so they decide to create a group team Kirat so people are asking why Kirat the Kirat is what they put there is the more on the bikes are uh, XR and uh, S1000R BMW so when you look at the the headlight that is one is small and one is big so they made the group called Kirat so I am there too so so there is a s little people on this group maybe below 10 on that group that is just a friends group so they know nothing to you know not like a other huge huge group so I asked them okay can we help this guy 
so uh, of course team carrot always help you know all the mahirap so they said okay so we just collect little bit of amount and I'm just going to give him maybe tomorrow or day after tomorrow and I will put it on the vlog like I mentioned before why I am putting it on the vlog because when some of you guys seeing my vlogs and if you get inspired maybe you also help others that is only the reason so in uh, in actually in my religion I am not a religious but it says if you give something to someone from right hand make sure your left hand doesn't know uh, that is actually in in our uh, religion says it means don't publish or don't give don't nobody let know that what you're doing but if I am following that one there will be so many of people like me willing to help they will never know and they won't get inspired so that is the reason I am putting it on the camera so I will talk about this later guys I am actually here in a Kawasaki crib you can see that is a Kawasaki crib let me put it inside I will show you later Kawasaki crib as usual Cheryl and all of them busy oh, masa. Masa. so guys later let me call Archie to show him my bike this part will be changed guys this, this is a part this is actually the master cylinder uh, so this is there is we lost the Indura so they are going to change the whole part this is a clutch master cylinder you can see so guys so for this one if you wanted to have a remove you really have to drain your coolant because you know it won't come out because there is a stretching here in the coolant box the coolant hose so we will remove this one we will drain the coolant then we will remove this this part it is a skeleton of ZH2 safe full of electronics inside outside so we are going to drain the coolant for to remove those clutch master boys remove the I know young coolant pipe now we will go into remove this thing this is a pressure rod it's called push rod or pressure rod whatever you can say this will be the one in case to your uh, clutch clutch lining so when you clutch is a hydraulic and there is a one piston if here is a one piston is pressed to the push rod the push rod goes to the your clutch lining and it will engage your clutch it's a nice technology see this this is a there is a part we are going to change it's a new one it will be replaced so see there is all paint is there I shows when you're doing something on the engine you need to have a top range and you need to give the proper tension of all the bolt so it's not like you know you can just say use any range and uh, you can just uh, tight it up it might break your covers so here is master master archie
yeah guys uh, you can see here actually we change and you know all is here no issues we change the, the new one so thank you kawasaki for your good service we, we have done our service in a kawasaki and uh, you can see it's replaced the new one so that is how the kawasaki uh, after sales work they are good actually they didn't uh, they asked me how it's happened or oh, i don't know it's happened it's there is no paint so they change so i will talk about this clutch thing in a while so about the clutch for uh, zh2 zh2 comes with the uh, you know hydraulic clutch system the hydraulic clutch system is actually uh, like a you know our front brake is comes with the master cylinder and the fluid and there is a hose is going to your uh, clutch master cylinder in in the down so there is no clutch cable there is a brake like a brake braid line tube is push the fluid to the master cylinder and the master cylinder has a piston is there and the piston push the push rod to the clutch lining and the clutch line get engaged that is how the clutch hydraulic clutch works so what happened was there is my clutch master cylinder i was uh, checking last two weeks ago there is some paint is come out so i messaged kawasaki that i said uh, how it's happening what's happening this one so they said uh, they have to inspect so i brought this one and you can see in my vlog i was riding with uh, i ride manila and i said that i am going to kawasaki to check yeah so i went to kawasaki to inspect what actually happened in that paint issue so they figure out that is actually when they are manufacturing and they didn't clean up and they paint and so the paint is came out so they said yeah, they had need uh, some time i said okay but kawasaki they are very fast and uh, they said after three days they messaged me they said sir the parts already we are sent it to kawasaki crib that is near to your place so you can go and change it so i was on ride and i said okay whenever i have a time i will just go and change the uh, master cylinder cover so today i got a time and i went there and uh, uh mr archie the head mechanic he replaced within 30 minutes so it's a good after sale service from kawasaki that's why most of my bikes are kawasaki and uh, i like kawasaki not only kawasaki i like all the bikes but uh, more on uh, i am into kawasaki but their after service is good also some other brand also good I like a uh, Ducati they also good uh, some other brand I have to go and uh, check it out how their service works and all then I will put it on my blog how the service center after sales works and all and uh, I will give you an update about those things guys on my blogs just uh, not only just to ride and uh, just to do over speeding and track days those, not those things I just want to give you an idea as a motorcycle rider as you guys watching as a motorcycle enthusiast so i can give you an update all the brand how they manage how they do the after sale how the service center works where is the service center located and all the stuff i will uh, tell you one by one by one on my blogs in upcoming blogs so i will give you an update probably i will be having uh, some new reviews in my new videos coming up so so you, you have to you just wait for uh, uh, for my uploads uh, you will see some of the epic crazy motorcycle 
I am going to review and I will give you all the updates on my channel anyway guys uh, this is for today and thank you for watching my channel and uh, please support like I always mention all the bloggers and uh, stay safe see you with some other motorcycle other content other reviews in my channel and uh, probably Saturday or Friday I am just uh, reviewing from here one of them from here to Kati yeah so probably I will be in the racetrack let's see how it goes I will keep you posted guys thanks for watching stay safe peace guys